The ball is stuck in the tree. I can't reach it. Let me have a go. No, it's too high. What can we do? What can we do? Chop the tree down. No! I can get it with my trunk. Ugh, no, I can't. If Emily can't reach it with her trunk, then we'll never get our ball back. What can we do? Chop the tree down. No! <laughs> George, come back, you little piggy. Hello, Susie. <laughs> Hello, Peppa. What are you doing? I'm learning to whistle, but I can't do it yet. Hmm, that sounds hard. It's impossible. Uh, can you whistle, Susie? No. <laughs> oh, good. I mean, that's sad if you can't whistle. But good, because I can't whistle. What's whistling, anyway? You put your lips together and blow. Like this. Hello, Peppa? And eat fruit and vegetables. Which one should we eat, Mr. Potato? Apples, oranges, carrots, tomatoes. Potatoes? Um. Why aren't you small, like a normal potato? Uh. Because he's not a normal potato. He's got legs. Normal potato. Potatoes don't have leg, leg. <laughs> you see, playing together is fun. <laughs> oh dear. It was your brother's fault. He broke George's sandcastle. Your brother broke my brother's sandcastle. It came up in the ocean and it's gone. And there's people that are dying. So first, a red apple. I've got a green apple. Let's swap. Okay. <laughs> Peppa, Susie, what are you doing? Susie told me to open my lunchbox. Peppa told me to swap our apple. You can whistle because you are old, Mummy. Thank you, Peppa. <laughs> Oh, I can see something else. There's an animal stuck in the tree. Is it a cat? No, I'm here. George is in the bedroom, playing with his toy rocket. George, I'm learning to whistle. You make an O shape with your mouth and blow. Don't worry, George. It's almost impossible. Like wiggling your ears. George can wiggle his ears. <laughs> Whistling is harder. George can whistle. Oh.